welcome to Free Focus Dance. I'm b by Push, and I'm gonna teach you guys how to break. So, we're gonna go through the very fundamentals of breaking. This is everything you need to know. It's not really gonna look like a move so much as it is just core concepts. This is gonna really explode your breaking game if you're new, if you're advanced, and you're not, not hitting things right, this is going to really, really help. So, we're going to break it down real quick. There's a few basic positions and postures you need to know, and it's going to really, really improve your game. So, first up is just your standing posture, okay? We, people like to call this your one, your starting position. Now, your starting position when you're normally standing is hyperextended legs. Some people will lean on one side or the other and dance. In a lot of sports, we want to bend our knees and we are gonna relax into the front of our toes, okay? We don't need to be on tippy toes, but we want to be on the front side of our toes and maybe about five, 10% of our weight on our heels. Just relax on the floor, but towards the toes so that we are ready to move, okay? You can think about this like you're playing basketball or something and you're trying to take a shot. You wanna be real ready to go, okay? so. We are going to practice just an easy bounce with our toes, okay? So while we're doing this, we can also think about the concept of rocking. So this is top rock, okay? And we also have upper rocking, and those come from the concept of our hip and our knees doing a rocking motion, okay? It's really subtle, and it'll look something like this, okay? And we're going to basically just bend our knees, have the weight going towards our toes, knees over the toes, have a nice straight posture that's relaxed, and we're just gonna bend our knees, bob our knees over our toes, okay? And let those toes act like a spring and bring our weight back up. And instead of standing up straight, we're going to want to bend the knees and just relax into a bent posture, okay? So, we're starting in our bent posture. We're gonna bob the knees, and as you see, as they come up, they're still bent a little bit. So we're going from bent to a little further bent, okay? And you can do this more or less, depending on how much bounce you want. It's more energy to go further down, give you a bigger bounce, or a smaller, more casual bounce just right in the knees over the toes, okay? And we can go towards our toes and just start picking our toes up. And as we bounce on each side, okay? So we're just gonna bounce on each side while we shift our weight from one side of our hip to the other side, okay? And this allows us to bounce, put them together, and we can also take a step with this. So we're, we're bouncing, and we just take a step open and a step together, step open, step together. This gives us our basic two-step, a side-to-side -side motion like this. And it's an easy way to practice your groove, practice it together, two-step, and also in a circle. Bounce, go in a circle, you can also try your side to side, hip to hip, okay? Boom. You can start putting a little bit more bounce into this, and you can start seeing how this starts to pick up, okay? We're gonna take this and utilize it going down, all right? So, standing up, this is our, this is a no-no position, this is our standing position, we don't wanna be here, we wanna have our knees bent, and then we're gonna bounce to st our second position, First position is standing, and we don't want to be hyperextended, so we bend. So this is our one, slightly bent knees. Position two, more bent knees. And we're gonna fluctuate between step one and step two. One, two, okay? We're gonna try to ride the music and get on the beat and start bouncing with it. This is, this is your home for all of your top rock, okay? We're gonna utilize this on the floor simply by squatting down. So if you hold your arms out as a balance, we're gonna go to our first position. And as we go to our second position, we're gonna keep going until we squat onto the back of our heels. 
you can see my legs kind of widen. This is a natural position. If they're together, it's gonna be harder to balance. If they're a little bit wide, it becomes easier to have a steady balance, okay? So this is our position on the floor. We have two main positions on the floor, this being our first one, and our second being an open posture like this. I call this a spider, okay? You can be here and make sure your hip is in the right position. We want it nice and level, we don't want it up, and we don't want it down, okay? Want it nice and easy, we should be able to lift our hands and lift our feet, okay? And it should be nice and easy, okay? All right, so that's the core position, top and bottom. So one more time, from the top, we squat down, we can let our knees come out, bring our arm down, okay? And we can start to rock our knee and our hips. So I'm gonna push my hip out to each side as I bring my arm down. So arm down, hip to the side, Arm down, hip to the side. You can see we're going opposite legs and opposite of our arm, okay? Legs are opposite of our arm. One, two, three, four, okay? So we're gonna go down real quick and hit that side to side motion, okay? So arms out, we go down, squat, put our arm down, leg goes out, switch sides, leg goes out. Boom, boom. Come to the center, and you can stand back up. Be careful on your knees, okay? This takes some time and practice. So we're gonna do this pull out, here we go. Go down, side, 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 and up, okay? An easier way to get up instead of just squatting all the way straight up is by opening our legs. So real quick, if we are squatting like this, as I bring myself up, this is where it starts to get hard to hyperextend. We can now jump out, boom, and it's easier to land and we can zip up at the end if we need. Okay, let's do that one more time. We squat, side, 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 together, and jump out, zip up, and you're finished. You can now walk out and finish your set. Okay, here we go all together. Down, side, 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 out, and zip up, okay? So, that was all the basic, basic stuff for posture. We didn't do too much. We really just went side to side with our hips and our knees, okay? So we went side to side with the top rock and side to side with our knees and a nice easy way to get up and stay in shape.